from one robot animal franchise to another. Welcome back to Tiger Wolf Productions, and today I've got something a bit different for you. Five Nights at Freddy's Pizzeria Simulator, the game that finished the entire FNAF saga. Well, at, at least then there was Ultimate Custom Night. And then there was FNAF VR, and then FNAF AR, and the very disappointing security breach. But to my mind, that's where FNAF ends. It ends at FNAF Pizzeria Simulator. It's the perfect send-off. Um, uh, I'm not here to talk about that game. I'm here to talk about merchandise from that game. Um, I have here a Molten Freddy construction set and a series of mystery minis to look at. So... We're going to start off by taking a look at the Molten Freddy construction set. And I guess we'll start off by having a look at Freddy Spaghetti himself, Molten Freddy. And he is a very nice little figure. Um, uh, if you are not aware, this is actually entered. <clears throat> Yes, entered from sister location in a, uh, a new form, if you will. So it's not just Funtime Freddy in here, it's also Ballora and Funtime Foxy, but obviously uh, Funtime Freddy is the most in control here. And uh, he's become this guy, he's become Molten Freddy, and he's really, really nice. Um... Opening his mouth here real quick. Actually, yeah, there's an endo under there. He's really, really nice. Really, really cool. He's got the... His entire body is basically an endoskeleton. And he's got just these wires for feet. If you don't know, Molten Freddy doesn't have feet. He's pretty much just a mass of wires wearing a mask. This arm is more mangled. And I guess if you look here, you can see it's not painted, but yeah, it's one of it's one of the eyes that are found throughout Ennard's body. That, that way you can tell this is in fact Ennard. And not just another model of Freddy. Face is really nice, really gruesome. You can open the mouth. That's one thing I wish the action figures could do is you can open the mouth. I like the top hat, it's kind of copper color. The eye is really nice. Very nicely detailed for such a little, little figure. Um, yeah, but that's Molten Freddy. Here's the chair he comes with. Um, he sits in it just fine. He requires the support of the table, which we will get to, but yeah, he sits in it just fine. Um, but yeah, it's a nice little chair. It's just a chair. I don't know what you can say about a chair. Musical chair. No. No, we won't go there. Yeah. It's a nice little chair he can sit in. Here's the table. The table has nice detailing on it. And if you look there, yeah, there's the... Uh, there's the uh, de device that emulates the, the voice of Henry, Mr. Cassette Man himself. Um, yeah. So let's put it all together. I think you'll find the result 
is rather nice. You, if you want, you can take Molten Freddy's arm, put it on the table here, as if he's slamming his hand down on the table. Really nice. I like this set quite a bit. He's drunk. Okay. Yeah, so that's the Molten Freddy construction set. If, if you can find this anywhere, just about anywhere, definitely do snatch it right up. It's really worth it. Yeah, so that's the Molten Freddy construction set. It's really, really cool. Anyway, let's talk mystery minis. Here we have Rockstar Freddy. Purple hat, top hat, star on the tummy, purple bow tie, as if he's a, as if he's sort of an amalgamation of Freddy and Fredbear. Red knees black joints it's not really red it's more of a maroon now that I look at it head does turn yeah. more purple on the microphone the microphone is nicely done As is his cute little face. Okay, so reminds me of Toy Freddy here with the cheeks. So it's like it's like an amalgamation of classic Freddy, Toy Freddy, and Fred Bear. No slot for coins here in the this is this is a pizzeria sim mini, not a FNAF, not an ultimate custom night mini. Although the next guy coming up kind of makes me think otherwise. But yeah, freckles, very nice teeth. Yeah, he's really cute. You can't go wrong with mystery minis. Well, except for an, another character you'll see here pretty soon. But, uh, yeah. Nice, cute shape to the ears. Blue eyes. Really, really nice. Um, I found... I found this guy... Uh, at GameStop recently. I don't know if they're re-releasing the FNAF 6 Mystery Minis. It seems like they are, but... Um, yeah... I found a lot of these guys at GameStop recently. Yeah, but uh, Rockstar Freddy is pretty nice. He's really cute. Um, let's go on to probably my favorite of the Rockstar gang. Here we have Rockstar Bonnie. He's a bright, well, he's not a bright blue, he's just a blue. His ears are really nice. Uh, very reminiscent of the Bon Bon attached to Freddy, uh, Funtime Freddy's hand. Now, this is interesting. Um, if you remember Rockstar Bonnie's mechanics in Ultimate Custom Night, um, the way to make him leave your office is you find his guitar on the cameras and give it back to him. He's without his guitar in this mini here. So I kind of wonder if Scott informed Funko about Ultimate Custom Night and they kind of made this mini to kind of coincide with his mechanic in the game. Yeah, green eyes, 
red cheeks, bow tie, kneecaps, guy liner. Nice buck teeth. And this adorable little tail at the back here. That is so cute. Tummy stars. Nose, really nice. Basically Frank Sinatra as an animatronic. Yeah. I really do wonder about if if Funko knew about Ultimate Custom Night, something we didn't back when it was still coming out. But yeah, again, black joints. Yeah, very nice. Place them down there. Um, Uh, there is one more rock star character I have, but I, I'm kind of going to kind of save him for last because, well, if you've seen the short I uploaded not too long ago, well, you'll see why. Here's Fun Time Chica. Yes, we all played Sister Location. We were wondering, where is Chica? Where is she? Where's she, where's she gone? Well, here she is. Um, yeah, Scott put her in FNAF 6 just for, you know, because he knew we were missing her. And then he put her in Ultimate Custom Night and gave her a very strange uh, mechanic that I won't mention here on the show. But uh, yeah, he, uh, she's mostly white, pink, orange. I like how she's got lipstick on her beak. That's... That's really neat. Here's the cupcake. The cupcake is really kind of scary, actually. See, she's holding it by the plate. Speaker. They even got her withering right here, right? Kind of wonder how this happened. Yeah, Rockstar Chica is really nice. Um, in fact, the only inaccuracy I can really find is uh, the, the 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 color around the eyes here. It's supposed to be orange, not pink. That's a very minor gripe. Um, yeah, she's she's really nice, really accurate to what you see in the game. eyelashes really nice like how she's got these sharp teeth here yeah so it's not rock star chica but you know she'll do actually if i get hang on If I get Fun Time Freddy here, she goes just perfectly with him. You know, she just she goes just fine with your secu uh, the security breach. No, we don't talk about that game here. Uh, your your sister location set. So, yeah, I pretty much consider her a sister location character. It's just me, though. But I'm including her here because she's in FNAF 6. Um, so, I guess now we can talk about... Whoops. <laughs> I guess now we can talk about these two. Um... Yeah. Uh, 
Um, yeah. Start with this one here because he came out first. Yeah, th this is um, Rockstar Foxy. The, the Rockstar Foxy Mystery Mini. Or it's supposed to be. Um, though it's not really. Um, <laughs> th there's nothing really Rockstar Foxy about this mini. Uh, nothing going on. Uh, for one thing, he's brown. Um, Rockstar Foxy is a very bright red color. Um, yeah. And, and his face isn't even colored He, he's kind of got this Mickey Mouse kind of patch in his face, and it's supposed to be pink. Uh, he doesn't have that here at all. Uh, I don't really have any other merch of Rockstar Foxy to show you, but uh, the, he's not brown. He's supposed to be red. His eye patch is supposed to be a different shape. The accordion, okay. The peg leg, all right. The yellow pants, uh, Rockstar Foxy, um, no. Rockstar Foxy does not wear pants at all. Um, and if you look at his arms and and the pants themselves, yeah, he, he's got withering on him, which, again, Rockstar Foxy is not supposed to have. Um, and then we get to this one here. This is the... Um, after these, these came out, which are, which are really the same thing, except they, they glow in the dark. And they could have fixed fixed it here with... He's more of an orange, I'll say that, but... And his muzzle is actually pinker, now that I look at it. But he's still missing the mark way off. Um, he's still got the wrong shape of the eye patch. Doesn't have the Mickey Mouse kind of face going on. He still has yellow pants. He still has withering. Yeah. It's pretty cool how you can see through his fingers here. Oh. He's got a black endo. He's got silver here. He's got a shinier hook. He's got just a plain white hook. Freckles, yeah, teeth. I mean, I mean, they're they're all right if. They're all right as, like, FNAF 1 Foxy, because that's what they look more like, to be honest. Um, though, they're not all right as Rockstar Foxy, because they look nothing like Rockstar Foxy. I... And the thing is... Um, the plushie got it right. The action figure got it right. The glow in the dark action figure got it right. For some reason, they couldn't do it here. So, 
So it's best if you don't look at these as Rockstar Foxy. Look at these as just... Look at them as FNAF 1 Foxy before he got out of order. That's, that's how I choose to look at them. Maybe, maybe Foxy had an accordion. Maybe he had a peg leg. Because, you know, in FNAF 1, his leg is still, like, you know, his legs are metal. You know? Yeah, so that's how I see these minis. I, I don't see them as Rockstar Foxy. I see them as pre-withered FNAF 1 Foxy. You know, even though even though there's withering here on the arms, which, you know, that is not supposed to be there. But yeah. Oh yeah, the, what glows on this guy? Uh, the eye, the teeth. This guy has a grill, legit. Like when he glows in the dark, he has like a, his bottom teeth are just like, they just pop. I believe the keys on the accordion and the hook. Oh, and the inside of the ears and the muzzle. I don't know if the pants glow. Yeah. So on that, so moving on from that bummer, um, here we have another glowing mystery mini. We have Pig Patch, and he's a lot nicer. Um, I like the look here. Looks like he's made out of candy, these two. Yeah. He's got the banjo. The banjo glows. The eyes glow. This one, I think, glows a bit better. Or it might be this one, actually. His snout glows, and the inside of his ears glow, too. He's got a curly tail. I always like that about Pig Patch. Pants. Ironically enough, which remind me of, again, a foxy. I've always kind of seen him as the foxy of the mediocre melodies, to be honest. Again, I like this. I like how you can see the banjo through his fingers here. <laughs> I just think that's really neat. He's got a chronic case of hillbilly teeth. I always liked how his eyes are two different colors. I've always seen him as the foxy of the mediocre military. Maybe he's closer to Bonnie because, you know, Bonnie has a guitar, he has a banjo. Uh, you may realize I've had a look at this guy before. And that was in that was when I took a look at the glowing Orville figure. Well, I'm taking a look at him again. For your enjoyment. Yeah, so he's really nice. Yeah, he's a good pick-me-up after, you know, after this. I'm sorry, but when, when you go from dedication like this and afterward you see something like this, you're just like, what happened? What, what were you guys doing? I, you know, yeah. So yeah, he's really nice. And last but not least, we have Orville Elephant with probably the happiest face I've ever seen on a murderous animatronic. 
this little trunk there. Look how freaking happy that is. Purple top hat, magic wand. Elephantine feet, very nice. Buttons, flower. Orange and yellow. I always liked Orville. I always liked the look of them. If you could just use that wand to turn this guy more accurate, that'd be great. But uh, yeah, blue eyes. Eyebrows, really cute. Yeah. Again, black joints. Um, just on the arms this time. But, eh, what are you going to do? I've already mentioned the trunk. <laughs> yeah, but really tiny little trunk. Really cute. Yeah, so yeah. So, it's really all I got. Just get everyone in here. Oh, not him. Yeah. Yeah, so today we had some look at we had a look at some FNAF six merch. Um this definitely recommend it um these guys well they're mystery minis it's a mystery so um definitely pick yourself a few boxes of these up um and uh if you happen to get rockstar foxy try not to think of it as rockstar foxy Th think of it as uh, pre-withered FNAF 1 Foxy because that's really what it really is um, <laughs> yeah that's, that's the best advice I can give you on that front but uh, yeah that's all I got pretty cool this is Tiger Wolf Productions I'm signing off see ya